All right, ladies and gentlemen, our next contest is for five rounds of fighting. And it's for the WKA Super Lightweight British Championship. Please welcome to the ring first your challenger, Anthony Ferguson. Welcome his opponent, he is your current WKA Super Lightweight British Champion. Here comes Lee Taggart. This one's scheduled for five rounds of fighting. And it's for the WKA Super Lightweight British Championship. Sponsored by Leo Decor. Introducing to you first, fighting out of the red corner. Representing Renegade Jim. He is your challenger. Make some noise for Anthony Ferguson. And his opponent, fighting out of the blue corner. Representing Choke D. Jim, he is your current super lightweight WKA British champion. Make some noise for Lee Taggart. And once again, when the action begins, your referee in charge, third man in the ring, is Chris Bachelor. So our big WKA British super lightweight title fight and the champion defending his title, Leif Taggart from the Chok the Rich Cadden there with him. And I've known Leif since he was a very young man indeed. All those years back when he was just a little up and comer and I was writing and then editor for Combat Magazine. And look at him now, known the country over, a multiple champion. And his challenger from the renegade gym, Anthony Ferguson over five three minute rounds. Change of kicks and Ferguson sharp there in response catches the leg left right leaves smiles as he took the right hand but he doesn't want to take many of them skips away from that right leg looks for his own chopping low kick left hand right leg bread and butter combination from the champion And again, Ferguson chops the leg, immediately response from the champion. Ferguson, though, found his range and timing early. Exchange of low kicks in the centre of the ring. And suddenly, high point from Taggart, the champion. Nice right hand from Ferguson, but he paid for it. Had to take a combination in reply. Doubles up the jab, the champion as he comes forward. Right hand lands clean for Taggart. Says it didn't hurt, but the warning signs are there. Nice left hand from the champ. Bubbling nicely this opening round. Both men staying in the pocket, firing off now. Check this time by the challenger, but Taggart comes forward once more. Steps away from the response from Ferguson. Left of the body. Again, that right leg caught by Ferguson. And the way they go again. right combination from the champ 
probing with the jab. Looks for the low kick. Ferguson responds. No, left and right. Superb left of the body, right to the head. Taggart grins again. A superb punch from the challenger there. Another big right. And another. Taggart comes back. What a chin so far from the young champion. Ferguson sets out his intent though with some blistering right hands here in the first. And another, and the champ responds in kind. What a start, what an opening round. And the champion's chin really tested by the challenger from the renegade gym. What an opening round, and you've got to go with the challenger for that one. Wow, four more to go. Chin of iron, Taggart, but he can't keep taking those rights. Ferguson set out his stall there. And there you see the challenger forging forward, and that right hand's the danger. The champion shrugs, but he can't keep taking them. There's a big one, he takes the backward step. Superb work from Ferguson, and then the champion comes back, doubling up his shots, and another big right hand from the challenger. And Taggart, the champion, stands his ground and fires back. He's made such an exciting opening round. But real intent from the challenger to take this British belt. So here we go for two of potentially five. And away they go once more. So Taggart got to be wary of the Ferguson right hand whenever he does his work. He's got to withdraw that left hand pretty quickly. Because Ferguson has fast, fast hands. This time it's the champ that gets through. Slips the punch, throws his own right. Good timing here from the champion. Now better start to the second round. Left and right, and he replies. Tit for tat here in the second. Nice work, the uppercut from the challenger, the key shot on the end of that combination. Champ doubles up the left leg kick, slips away from that right hand this time. Right left, right low kick. Champ beginning to warm to the task now. He laughs again, but Ferguson has really landed it. And he must wonder, what have I got to do to rock this man? Taggart looks to take the leg and the support leg, not quite in time, but the knee comes in and his own right hand beginning to get his way back into this round solidly. Round kick as Ferguson comes in. Pushes him, the challenger back. And again, they both land stiffly. Round kick from the champion. Ferguson pressing the action once more, takes a short right himself. And that right again. Taggart, good work to the body. Evil intent there on Ferguson as he comes forward. Round kick and the movement from the champion. Kicks again, and each time he kicks, the challenger looks to reply with that right hand, but this time the champion steps up the combination. Better round for the champion. Again, ships the right, shrugs. Perfectly timed kick in response. Checks the kick. Right hand just skims him this time. Ferguson stalking once more. Taggart chops away at the lead leg. Chops away at it again, last 10 seconds. Ferguson looks for that right and the left lands this time right on the bell. Better round for the champion, but Ferguson so, so dangerous. Taggart looking to stand and trade with the challenger this round, but that's the right hand, he takes it so well, he smiles again. 
But it's clean over the top from Ferguson. And the uppercut takes one in reply. A lot of the time, anybody else in there, you'd be saying, well, that's a fight finisher right there. And the left hand right on the bell from Ferguson as well. Very, very dangerous challenge indeed to the Chuck Dean man. Three of five, and Ferguson really going for the champion's belt. Right hand lands again as Taggart comes forward. He's walked forward right through these opening two rounds. He's doing the same in the third. Nice movement from Taggart, though. Again, the challenger looking to land that right. Taggart using lateral movement now. Blocks that kick, looks to respond. Ferguson targeting the league leg of the champion now. And then the right hand pops out again and again. Champion has to come to terms with the Ferguson right hand if he's to retain this title. High point kick from the champion, then front push kick, perfectly timed. Better from the champion. Standing and trading with the challenger now. Ferguson focused and determined. There's those heavy hands again, chopping low kick in reply from the champion. Coming forward now. Using the cheat. The right hand snaps the head of the champion back once more. Ferguson stalking. Taggart responds. Nice movement there from the champion. The left hook to follow. Ferguson checks the kick. Stays in the pocket. Slight lateral movement again from the champion. Lands with the kick to the leg. Takes that right hand once more. And another. Shakes his head again. Stands and trades with the challenger. What about? And again, the heavy shot from the challenger. He thinks, what have I got to do to rock the champion here? Because he's landing cleanly here. Taggart comes through with the left hand, looking to push forward. Round kick to the midsection. Last 10 seconds again. Blocks the kick this time. Perfect timing from the champion. Wow, three hard, hard rounds. Anthony Ferguson really asking questions of the challenger, Lee Taggart. Such a resilient champion. And again, there's the right hand. It comes through the channel. And I've seen shots like this put men away, one punch, and it's all over and the belt changes hands. Not in this case, look at that. Right through the channel, the head snaps back. And again. Teeing it up, Taggart chops low, off balance. Here comes another. So round four of five. And away they go once more. Following a familiar pattern, staying in the pocket. Garrett, Leif Taggart looking to chop away the legs of the challenger, Ferguson, who uses that right hand to constantly pepper the face of the champion, Taggart. As he does so again. Comes in once more. A 
again. Taggart looks to target the lead leg, but as he does so, the immediate response from Ferguson is that right hand. Teeing it up now, doubling to the body and head. And again, the chopping kicks of the champion to try and keep his challenger away. And to slow him down and work those legs. And the right hand comes in again from Ferguson. Familiar pattern to this bout. Hard and hurtful and consistent. Inside leg this time from the champ. Takes that one on the shoulder, more of a slip. Certainly wasn't landing cleanly this time. One of the few times it hasn't when he's thrown it. That lead leg of Ferguson being targeted now by the champion. Snaps that right in again. Takes the champion's attention. And another huge right, and Taggart just acknowledges it and comes forward again. Stiff left from the champ, he smiles. Work to the body and head again from Ferguson. The legs of Taggart, the response. What a round, what a fight. And again, Taggart with his back to the ropes, throws that left leg. Ferguson looks to rock the champion once more, who responds with his own left hand. Backs him up, looks to throw that heavy right once more. Banging them through. And Taggart's going to get a count now. This could be decisive. Rich Cadden not happy with that. That's a mountain to climb for the champion now. Ferguson pushing forward. Left and right again. Taggart digs deep and throws the left leg. And again, as Taggart lands, Ferguson throws that big right. He plants his feet with every shot now. Oh, and the head snaps back once more right at the end of the round. Rich Cannon unsettled by that call. He's got a lot to do for this fifth and final. That was four, wasn't it? get his champion back on track after that count. Ferguson relentless, like a pit bull, the way he stalked the champion. And it's bombs like this, stalking his man. Every time he takes the kick, he responds with that big right hand through the channel, snapping the head back. Chris Batchelder, a referee, looking closely every time he comes forward. Leaf. Backed up in the corner, the body and the head, another big headshot. He shakes his head, comes in again. A lot of this bout, and there's those final shots where he steps in and says, I'm going to give the count here. And that was right at the bell. Wow, one last round. So they stand and trade at the fifth and final, they know what's at stake here. And this time Taggart responds with his own left and right. Standing in the pocket with Ferguson, you can't ask for more at the end of the fifth here. Listen to the crowd respond to this. The champion standing toe to toe with the challenger, both throwing the shots. What about? And this is the fifth and final round. Taggart lost that point in the fourth, and here they go again, taking the shots to respond. Toe-to-toe, -to -toe, what a great bout. And here they go again. Taggart responds. Both men slip now on this canvas. Just at fever pitch as well. So here they go once more, and Ferguson... Oh, and then suddenly, the champion comes back and rocks the challenger. 
Unbelievable here. Trager is going to give him the count. What a turn around here from the champion. Unbelievable stuff here in the fifth and final round. And the champion pushes forward again. His rock solid chin and now the challenger is on the back foot. Unbelievable stuff here, the high point kick. Ferguson grits his own teeth and fires back. Tagger now pushing in hard and fast. Spins with the kick. Ferguson comes back again and Tagger rocks him again. He's taken so many shots and here he is now rocking the challenger in the fifth, getting the count in the fifth. The cheap kick. Then Ferguson comes back. Unbelievable. What a fight. And here they go again. Oh, superb stuff. This was a movie you'd say it was unbelievable. But here they are. On the right of Ferguson lands. And Taggart sweeps his man to the canvas. And once more they go. Uppercut attempt from Taggart. Ferguson lands with the right. And another big right from the champion this time. What a bout. And another clubbing right as Ferguson comes forward. Big, big round for the champion. Last 10 seconds. Listen to this crowd, they know what they've witnessed here. One of the fights of the year. Unbelievable stuff, this. Wow, unbelievable. Superb stuff. I have been privileged to witness one of the great title fights. Listen to this crowd. The icing on the cake of an incredible show tonight. Wow, I have seen it all with that bout. I have seen it all. Look at this, look, look. And then Taggart comes back. Toe to toe, shot for shot. And suddenly, it's the challenger that gets the count. Taggart, jaw of steel. Ferguson, what a fight. Look at this. In the fifth and final round. The crowd are on their feet here. Oh, unbelievable stuff here at Superfight Series 2 at the Albans Arena. They'll be talking about this one for years. Look at that, look at that right hand from the champion now. What a bout. All right, here we go. After five rounds of fighting, we go to the judges' scorecards. The judges score this bout 48-45, 48-46, and 48-45 for your winner. And new WKO Super Lightweight Women's Champion, Anthony Ferguson. I was about to say I had a gut feeling that Ferguson was going to take the title, but I'm not going to say too much on that now because that was just simply one of the greatest fights I've seen in a long time. And either of these men are worthy champions. Ferguson is the new champion, but what a great display by both men. I had a feeling over those first four rounds the challenger would take it, and then Leaf came back in the fifth with the knockdown and the count of his own. But we have a new champion. But do you know what? Both these men are champions in my eyes.